Hi, my name is Paul Saver, the founder of Parent Teenage Relationship Saver, and welcome to this next training video titled, Can You Really Spoil a Child by Loving Them Too Much? When I was a child growing up and as a teenager and as an adult later on, um, I often heard my parents or relatives or friends of the family warn of the dangers of spoiling a child. It was inferred that if you uh, give too much attention to a child, they'll end up becoming soft and needy. And when they become an adult, unable to cope with real life pressures. Hence, you have many parents today who subscribe to the view of allowing a child to cry themselves to sleep. Or fathers who believe that too much attention will cause, uh, disturb their son's mas masculinity. But what does it research actually tell us? Well, the research says that you can never love a child too much. Secondly, the best adjusted kids are always the ones who receive the highest levels of parental love. And thirdly, the more love a child receives, the less needy they become as an adult. When we speak of uh, spoiling a child, we're not talking about expressing too much love. So what do we mean by a spoiled child? Well, a spoiled child is usually the consequence of giving a child things in the place of love. Things like leniency, lowered expectations, and material things. In other words, um, a child is adversely affected when a parent fails to set limits when they lower expectations as a way of being nice and when they give things like toys or food or gifts in the place of genuine expressions of affection and attention. That's the problem. So, can you love a child too much? Can you spoil a child by loving them too much? The research says emphatically and definitively the answer is no. But the real problem we have in the world today are the millions of children, even billions of children, who are starved of love and attention. You know, the child psychologist, uh, Uri Bronfenbremer, he says that every child ought to have at least one adult in their life who is irrationally committed to them in order to grow and mature into a healthy human being in every sense of the word. This is Paul Saver of Parent Teenager Relationship Saver, urging you as a parent to get crazy for your child, whatever their age.